how to install Pro Java Launcher on iOS device. Alright, so let's begin with the video. This tutorial will show you how to play Minecraft Java Edition on iOS devices running iOS 15, 16, 18 or 18.5. Please note that this video is for educational purposes only. I do not promote any third party apps that violate community guidelines. Now let me walk you through the steps to download and install this game. First, go to your browser and visit the main website of Po Java Launcher on GitHub. This is the official Minecraft Java Edition launcher for Android and iOS based on Boardwalk. The repository contains the source code for Android, but you can install it on both Android and iOS devices. There are many repositories listed, but you don't need to click on any of them, just scroll through the page. You'll see a description explaining that Po Java Launcher allows you to play Minecraft Java Edition on your iOS or Android devices. To install Po Java Launcher, locate the IPA file for iOS. Once you find it, download the IPA file. After downloading, you'll need an IP assigner to install it on your iOS device. If you're using Android, you can simply download it from the Google Play Store. For iOS installation, after downloading the IPA, open your IP assigner. In my case, I'm using Flex Store, but you can also use eSign or Scarlet if you have them. In Flex Store, click on Sign Application to start the process. You will see an interface where you need to select the IPA file. Click on Select IPA, choose the downloaded Pro Java Launcher IPA file, and then click on Sign Up. The app will be uploaded and signed and afterward you will see an install button. Click on it to install Po Java Launcher onto your iOS device. I have already installed it, so I'm just showing you the process here. Once installed, you can log in with your demo account and download Minecraft Java Edition. There are many versions available and you can select the version you want to play. So that's basically how you can install Po Java Launcher on iOS device. So that's all for this video. Consider subscribing if you find it helpful. And I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.